People in general feel most powerful when in groups. It's called a gang mentality. It has shown us that ordinary people are willing to do things they would never usually do as long as everyone else around them are doing it too. A riot is very similar to a fire. It can start off small and contained but very quickly spread and become out of control. In this list we'll be showing you five of the biggest riots ever recorded. We would like to give a big shout out to viewers Killer Hopper and that random YouTuber for suggesting this video. Number 5. London Riots Following a peaceful march on the 6th of August 2011, in relation to the police response to the fatal shooting of Mark Duggan, a riot began in Tottenham, North London. In the following days, rioting spread to several London boroughs and districts and eventually to some other areas of England, with the most severe disturbances outside London occurring in Birmingham, Bristol and Manchester, as well as some other cities in the Midlands and northwest of England. Related outbreaks also occurred in many smaller towns and cities. There was widespread looting and vandalism up and down the country. Five people died and at least 16 others were injured as a direct result of related violent acts. An estimated £200 million worth of property damage was incurred and local economic activity was severely compromised. Number 4. Detroit Riots the Detroit riots of 1967 began when police vice squad officers executed a raid on an after-hours drinking club in a predominantly black neighborhood. They were expecting to round up a few patrons but instead found 82 people inside holding a party for two returning Vietnam veterans. The police arrested all of these people and this resulted in widespread rioting. The riots began in the northeast section and spread to the east over the course of five days. Widespread looting fires and killings took place and the situation got so bad that the National Guard and the 82nd Airborne Division were mobilized to quell the violence. When it was over, 43 people were dead, 1,189 were injured and over 7,000 people were arrested. Number 3. Brixton Riots the riots that erupted in Brixton, London were some of the worst the UK has ever seen. On the evening of April the 10th, 1981, police arrived at the scene of a stabbing to question the young black victim. As they tried to get him in the car to take him to the hospital, civilians tried to intervene. The police were attacked but eventually managed to quell the situation. Because of the incident, police increased their numbers patrolling the streets. On the very next day, dubbed the Bloody Saturday, angry citizens began to to pelt police cars with bricks, which resulted in almost 280 injuries to police and 45 injuries to members of the public. In addition, over 100 vehicles were burned, including 56 police vehicles, and almost 150 buildings were damaged, with 30 burned. Number 2. Bombay Riots in 1992, some of the worst riots of all time occurred in the city of Bombay, India. The riots started as a result of communal tension prevailing in the city after the Babri Mosque demolition on December the 6th. It is commonly believed that the riots occurred in two phases. The first phase involved the Muslims striking the Hindus as a result of the demolition of the mosque, and the second was the Hindu backlash against the Muslims. Overall, about 900 people were killed in these riots. As with most riots, arson and theft were also prevalent. Number 1. LA Riots on 29th of April 1992, a jury acquitted two white police officers of charges stemming from a videotape beating of black motorist Rodney King. As a result of this verdict, thousands of citizens rioted for six days. Mass amounts of looting, murder, arson and assault took place. 53 people died during the riots, including 10 shot dead by the army and police, with as many as 2,000 people injured. Estimates of material losses vary between about 800 million dollars and one billion dollars. Approximately 3,600 fires were lit, destroying 1,100 buildings with fire calls coming once every minute at some points. Stores owned by Koreans and other Asian immigrants were widely targeted, although stores owned by Caucasians and African Americans were as well. 
Thank you for watching and if you have a video idea, why not leave a comment below and if we make it, we'll give you a big shout out. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe for more awesome daily lists of all things 5. This is all 5 and until next time, feed your mind.